Hello guys, welcome back to Razor and Tech Productions. Today, I'm going to show you guys how you can download Play on Linux on your Chromebook. So before we start, I'm going to go ahead and put up the system requirements on the screen for 10 seconds. And while we're doing that, I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys what Play on Linux is. Play on Linux is just one but as an application. And a lot of apps have been tested on Play on Linux. And I'm going to give you guys just six out of all of those apps that have been, te that have been tested. We have Explorer, iTunes, Adobe Creative Cloud, Fallout, Doom, and Skyrim. So if you're a fan of any of those games, Play on Linux is for you. So now we can go ahead and start. So go ahead and pull up your tutorial. I will put the link to this tutorial in the description for you guys so you guys can do it yourself. So now all you need to do is open up your terminal and put in sudo apt get update so we can update the service. Make sure everything is up to date. After you do that, we just need to add architecture i386 and then update again. And once that gets done, we just need to download Wine. This part will take the longest out of the whole tutorial. So you can download Wine32 or you can just download Wine. And if you just download the um, Wine command, then it'll download the latest version. But if, if you have a 32-bit architecture um, computer, then I advise you to use Wine32. If you don't have a 32-bit architecture computer, then I advise you to use just the regular Wine command. Okay. And then once we do that, Now, so I'm not going to make you guys wait for this, but it'll be done in a minute. Okay, guys, I mean, I'm not going to make you guys wait for this, so I'll be back once it's done. Okay, guys, and so now we're back, and now we just got a few more things we need to do. We need to download drivers, and we need to download Git text and Netcat. So just go back to the tutorial and download these drivers. I think a few of these drivers were downloaded with one whenever we downloaded it. So, yeah, I think, by, I think one of yeah, here we go. We just put Y to 65.5 kilobytes. Once that's done, we, just, we can just go ahead and update one more time. And once we're done updating, we just download Netcat and Get Text. But after we download those, we're still not done. And download Netcat. And then get text. Okay, that's done. And then get text. Okay. And then once you do that, well, I'm not even going to wait for this part. Now I need you guys to go to these sites. I will put a link to these websites in the description for you guys so you guys can go here by yourselves. And what I need you guys to do is once you get to this site, just press Debian, and then you see this. Don't press it yet. You need to go to this site first, and you need Image Max Six Common before you download the other one. Because if you don't download this one first, it's not gonna work. So just download this first one, FTP.us. Once you download that, then go ahead and download it. And then once you do this, once you download the Image Mac, just download Play on Linux, and then it should work. And I'm going to go ahead and end off the video here. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, like. Remember, guys, I'm trying to get to my like goal and sub goal. My sub goal is 50 subscribers. We can get there. We have 14 subscribers right now. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.